I'd like you to try something for me. I want you to try and imagine a world without money. A world that doesn't use money at all. No banks, no cash, no wages, no bills. No money of any kind whatsoever. What do you see? Let me guess. Maybe you imagine everyone going back to a more primitive lifestyle, living a meagre existence with growing their own crops and livestock, kind of like peasants. Or maybe you see a complete breakdown of society, no laws or social order, with people desperate or too lazy to grow their own food, stealing it from others, or maybe even killing each other to survive. Doesn't sound like a very attractive prospect, does it? Well, supposing I told you that that is not what would happen, that in fact a deliberate decision to stop using money would actually make our lives many times better than they are now. Look at your life right now, for example. Just how free are you? Do you owe money to anyone or to a bank? Like a credit card debt or a mortgage, maybe? You can't just ignore these things, can you? If you don't pay them, you might end up losing your home or even put in jail. And what about your job? If you have a job and you love it, great, but... Most people only work because they have to. You have to work to pay your bills. If you don't work, the lights go out, the water gets turned off, phones disconnected, you can't buy food, etc, etc. So you're not really that free at all, are you? And like most people, you probably think that this is simply a fact of life. You have to work to make money to live, just like our parents did. Well, let me tell you, this is not a fact of life anymore. Let me explain why. Firstly, bear in mind that we don't actually need money, we just need the things that money buys for us. Like food, clothing, a home, electricity, phone, computer, and so on. Money itself is just a middleman, which on its own is completely useless, and just causes misery to anyone who doesn't have enough of it. Now with today's technology, just about everything we produce for ourselves is done by machines or computers. In fact, this is the very reason why we have huge unemployment everywhere. The machines are taking all our jobs. But if you stop and think about that, this is really a good thing. Technology has completely freed us from hard labour. We should be celebrating that fact. So if we don't need people to produce the stuff we consume, then it surely follows that producing these things is a very easy thing to do. And if producing stuff is easy, then there's absolutely no reason at all why we shouldn't be doing it for everybody, is there? Not just the ones who can pay. At the moment, our economy is all about moving money around, and nothing to do with actually giving us what we need. It doesn't make sense, does it? The only constraint to producing the goods we need should be what's physically possible, and not what's affordable. Believe it or not, our planet has plenty of resources to provide for everyone. The only thing we're short of, it seems, is money. So why not just make everything free? Forget about money altogether. Why not? It's our world, we can make our own rules. The only thing money creates is inequality. A scoring system for humanity that decides who gets what. For the first time in history, our technology allows us to do away with this notion of haves and have-nots. And that's only the beginning. Making our world free would unleash our full technical potential, allow us to tap into clean energy sources, bring meaningful prosperity and knowledge all across the world, and even put an end to war and injustice forever. Just imagine food produced to the highest standards in plentiful supply. Bigger, better hospitals and schools with no budget problems. Clean energy and communications available to everyone. Space exploration. Underwater cities. Who knows? Take away cost and the only limit is our imagination and the raw materials needed to make whatever we want. In today's society, if you don't have money, Basically, you die. This is not just wrong, it's completely immoral, because it's unnecessary. There is another way, a new way. 
A free world without money, where everything is free, where you are free, where we can provide for everyone and finally see an end to starvation and poverty, where society is as fair as it possibly can be, where technology, unhindered by costs, is so advanced that we would hardly recognise ourselves. And it's all possible now, if we choose it. The Free World Charter is a simple document that defines ten fundamental principles on which to build just such a new society. These principles are not rules or laws, they are just simple statements on common sense, the common good and the survival of us and our planet. A society faithful to these principles will ultimately have no need for laws. By signing the Free World Charter, you are simply saying yes please to a fairer, freer and better world for everyone. Please sign it today at freeworldcharter.org. Thank you very much.